so hi hello everyone welcome to the channel and today i will show you how to create and edit features in arcgis pro so let's get started so now let us create a feature class in arcgis pro so to create a feature class in arcgis pro go to the option called view so now let me click this option call, called uh, catalog pane so now it has been uh, open here so uh, it has been open here in catalog so now let us go to the option called folders so now let me click this option so now click this option called my project one so which is indicated here this is about my project one so now here we can able to visualize dot gdb the geo database so here where our feature class like point line and polygon will be stored so now to create a feature class all you have to do is click this option called my project dot gdb right click and select new and click this option called feature class so now let us uh, name our feature class so let me name as a demo features so we're going to digitize the different features that is available in this particular study region so this is Chennai so here we can uh, digitize a uh, different features so here you can uh, visualize the several features being available in this study region so we have a lakes we have several lakes in this study region and uh, and uh, a lot of settlements so you can observe here there is a, a huge amount of settlements being observed in this area and also vegetation you can observe the vegetation so uh, we're going to uh, digitize different features in this study region so here we have our uh, river so this particular river is called as a as a kuam so it is a river here in the in this study region and the second river we have adaya river and we are specifically going to digitize a few settlements and vegetation in this study region so for that i'm going to select the feature class type will be polygon so we have several uh, different uh, features like line point and uh, in this video i'm going to select the polygon so now to create a feature class just click this option called finish So now we can able to visualize in the table of content section there is a new uh, feature class called demo features. So and your feature class files will be available here in this uh, folder. So my project dot gdb that is geo database the demo features. So which is indicated here in the table of content section. So we have created a feature class that is available in this folder called my project dot geo database. So it is indicated here so we can create a different feature classes so in this uh, feature we have created polygon so you can also create a feature class point line and polygon so suppose if you want to create this particular uh, road networks so you can see there is a road networks being uh, indicated in this color that is in uh, red color so uh, you can suppose if you want to digitize this road network you can use uh, specifically the feature called uh, line and suppose if you want to show uh, highlight this vegetation around this study region you can use a polygon and suppose if you want to so if you want, if you want to show the uh, show the name of this uh, specific uh, region you can indeed use the point tool to indicate the name of this uh, specific region so this uh, we have created a polygon feature so let's uh, start start digitizing different features in our study region so to start digitizing go to the option called edit so now click this option called uh, create create features so now a new window has been popped up here indicating create features so now let us have a look of this so let me click this uh, feature on uh, demo features so we have uh, several different tools being indicated here so here you can visualize the different uh, shapes are being available which will be very useful to draw our features in this study region so here i will select this uh, specific uh, tool called polygon create a polygon features so i will click this uh, i click you can see now it is our demo feature uh, shape file our demo features has been highlighted here so uh, let's start drawing our uh, so now let us start digitizing this uh, stadium called chidambaram stadium so let me digitize it now let us start digitizing the stadium
So now have uh, you can visualize it. I have digitized this stadium called Chidambaram. So now to finish this polygon, you have to double click it. So now you can visualize it. We have digitized the stadium and it is highlighted. So now let me digitize another feature in the study region. So now let me select this particular uh, building. So let me digitize it. So to finish the polygon, you have to dub double click it. So now let me uh, digitize this building here. So I'm digitizing it right now. So I've digitized the building here. And now I'm going to digitize another building which is closer to this building. So for that, I'm going to use this tool called, uh, let me click this option called Auto Complete Polygon. So it's creating an adjoining polygon using an existing polygon in the same layer to complete the coincide edges. So uh, let me click this. So now let me create. So now, uh, now let me create a polygon here. So now uh, let me auto complete this feature. So let me place a uh, digitize this area around it. So now let me double click this. So now the auto complete has been completed. So this tool is very essential to avoid overlapping of polygon. So for that we are specifically using this tool, uh, tool called auto complete polygon. So now let me zoom into the study region. So you can see there is a overlapping is being completely avoided in, uh, in this study region. So to avoid overlapping of a uh, polygon. So we had to use this specific tool called uh, auto complete polygon. So now we have uh, digitized two different uh, buildings in this study region. So, but you could like to view this as a one building. So for suppose to merge these two building together, we have to use this option called click this option called select. So now I have clicked this option called select tool in that I have specifically selected the rectangle. So let me draw a rectangle around this uh, two buildings. So now you can clearly visualize it. We have selected the building one and building two. So now we're going to merge these uh, two buildings together as a one building. So now to merge these two polygons together, we had to go to the another tool called modify. So I have clicked modify. So it is highlighted here as a modify features. So now uh, let me select a tool called merge. So because we're going to merge this building one and building two together as a one building. So for that, let me uh, search by merge. So now I have entered as a merge. Now let me uh, enter. So now you can able to visualize it. We have our merge tool that is. Uh, so let me click this. Now click this tool called merge. So now let me say I have selected the layer. So it is our demo features layer. So now all you have to do is so click this option called merge so now let me click this option so I click the merge so you can now visualize that the two building has been merged together as one building suppose uh, if you created a polygon and uh, you have realized that it should be uh, it should have been uh, multiple polygons so in that case we can use a tool called split tool so it split the polygons into a uh, different polygons so for that again go to the tool section tool called modify now click this option called split so it divides the so it divides a polyline or a polygon features into two features along a splitting line you create across the feature click the polyline segment to divide the features without using a, a splitting line so now let me click this tool So now to chop this polygon uh, into, uh, into a smaller polygons, you have to click this option called split. So I have selected the split. So now uh, let me chop this polygon. 
so now let me double click this so now we have two different polygons the single polygon has been uh, split it into two different polygon so polygon a and polygon b and suppose if you want to make this uh, if you want to undo the changes you have made so we had to go to this option called uh, click this option called undo so now it has been uh, converted to a single polygon so now let me click this undo again so now we have two different polygons and if you want to redo this thing you have to click this option called redo So in this video, I have shown you how to uh, create feature and edit feature using ArcGIS Pro. And I have shown you how to digitize the different features that is available in this study region. And I uh, shown you the merge and split tool. So in our next video, I will show you how to name a different features we have created in this, in this study region. So thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel and give us a like.